In this video, I'm going to show you how to install Linux on Windows 10 using WSL2. So the first step, you need to right click on the start and I assume for before you start that you have already upgraded to the latest version of Windows 10. This feature would work on your desktop or laptop from Windows 10 May 2004 update. Just to see your version of Windows right here, Winver, search for Winver and execute it. You will be able to see the version of Windows. For my case, it is version 20H2. The OS build is 19.0 or something. First, we need to enable WSL for Windows. For that, we need to right click on the start and open Windows PowerShell as admin. Click on yes and this window would open up. Now wait for some time unless this line comes up. When this line is here, paste a command and wait for some time unless the features are enabled. Provided you have done step 1 successfully, now you need to enable the virtual machine feature in your computer. For this, you need to run the following code that I am entering here. So first step after this, you need to clear, you need to enter the following code as I am entering here. I will leave this down in the description again so that you can just copy and paste from there. DISM, okay, DISM.exe slash online slash enable dash feature slash feature name virtual machine platform slash all slash no restart that's it hit enter after the process is done, you need to download the Linux kernel update package. For this, I am going to provide a link in the description from where you will get it. After the download is complete, open the downloads folder and start the application. Click on next in order to install the application. After the application is installed, you will get the confirmation message and you click on finish. After finishing the installation, you again need to start Windows PowerShell as admin and enter this code that is WSL set default version 2. When you execute this code, the version of Windows subsystem of Linux will be set to 2 and you can easily get going with this. Next steps are very easy. You just need to go to Microsoft Store and search for your favorite version of Linux. For example, you want to go for Kali, you know, just enter Kali and click on the appropriate version and click on install and that will be done.